phones from Micromax's U-Brand have always been priced attractively, but U-Phones have also been about disrupting the market. Just going over the spec sheet, it was evident that the phone had the resume to be the best in its category. Packing 4G capability, 720p display, 1GB RAM, and an 8MP camera, the U-Unique comes right at the top of the stack, at least in the specs table. However, has U been able to put all these specs in the Unique to work? Let's find out. At Rs. 5000, we weren't expecting a superb design and build, but the phone managed to beat the odds. The matte finished plastic on the back and Gorilla Glass 3 on the front puts it comfortably above other phones in this category. The 8.3mm thick body combined with a easy to hold sub 5 inch display offers better ergonomics as well. Talking about the buttons, the physical layout is similar to what we've seen on the U Euphoria. Fit and finish of keys and removal back panel are quite good for the price. This is the first time a phone in the sub 5K price point boasts a 720p HD display. The display, like the design, sports a higher resolution than other phones in this category. Yes, the colors are a bit washed out, but at Rs. 4,999, it is still the best display out there. The UI on the Unique was a surprise. Unlike previous U phones that ran on Cyanogen Mod out of the box, the Unique has an all stock Android interface. The software is well tailored to the phone with changes only to the camera app. The U Unique is powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 410 SoC. This SoC has been around in the sub 7K mobile market for quite some time, but U has brought it to the sub 5K segment. The U Unique deals with daily tasks like calling, browsing, chatting, etc. without any hiccups, but I did feel the phone lag occasionally when the 1GB RAM was pushed to its limit. Gaming performance is decent as well, and I was able to run heavy games like Asphalt 8 without any major issues. While the overall performance is good, I do have one complaint. The 8GB of storage is not enough in current times. Comparing it to other phones in its price category, one can see that this is the best phone in the segment in terms of processor performance. Calling and 4G capabilities work as intended. The sound quality via headphones is very good, despite the fact that it is made on a tight budget. The rear-mounted speaker, however, is not that loud. In our normal battery test, the U Unique was able to go 5 hours without charging, which is lower than my expectations. I believe the Snapdragon 410 SoC on this phone is not tuned properly to save battery. On a regular day's usage, the phone was able to manage around 6 to 7 hours without any gaming, with the phone losing about 30% battery after an hour of gaming. Coming to the camera, the 8 megapixel rear sensor from Omnivision does a pretty good job. Images taken in normal lighting conditions are good and the camera is able to reproduce a lot of details. Image quality in low light conditions is also respectable. The U Unique has a lot going for it, best in class performance, 720p display and a very good camera for the price. The phone falls short only in the battery department but is still a very good device. So if you have a budget of 5k or even 6k, the U Unique is a very good buy. As for the flash sale model, I can only suggest you to be patient or else up your budget and buy the Xiaomi Redmi 2 Prime.